enjoy some talk louder. <laughs> okay, sorry. But um, yeah, just those kind of things. And then they want to train you, kind of mold you, how they want you to be. Okay. Um, but I stayed with them for 11 years. I knew I could always go back to school. Right. Right, right, right. Um, but I kept getting promoted mm -hmm. up the ladder. That's so awesome. I, said, yeah, I had a great career with them. I learned so many things that actually helped me with my writing. Yeah, well, that's my second book. Yeah, to help me write in general. So, with, okay, so then you started doing the speech pathology. What are the benefits to that? I mean, is it something that you're passionate about? Or? Very. Very. Okay. <laughs> Everything that I do to want is is um, to help the parents, to motivate them, um, to bring positivity, to encourage them to the others. Um, I majored in speech pathology because um, my undergraduate degree in English and communication is tied in very well with speech pathology. It's about communication. So what I do is help patients who have some kind of speech and get better. So it all kind of ties in some help. Okay. Um, and then with my books, my books are about motivating our youth and helping them understand it doesn't matter where you are where you come from, where you are at this point in your life, mm -hmm. you can still get to where you want to be. Right, right. You know, so. But, because you create fundamentals. I have. Well. Okay. I have, and they're all based on the things that I have utilized throughout my life. Okay. Uh, to get from point A to point B. Okay. I put myself in undergraduate and graduate school based on the five principles in my book. Awesome. Which is, again, okay. yeah. Okay, so you've had success with, with it. I have. Okay. I have. Yeah. And um, I truly believe it, and that's why I keep. This is my. This, this is my platform. Okay. So, you know, for my next book, you'll we'll see little bits and pieces of it there too, because everything I do, I feel like it's based on those five things that keep me motivated, keep me going, and keep me helping other people. Okay. And you know, those things are just begin the work again, believe in yourself, empowerment. Get up. You got to get up. To right. Make things happen. And other people want to help you. Right. And then you got to initiate. You know, you can't just sit back. You got to initiate something. Have right. a goal set. And then the end stands for never give up. Okay. And that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> so, with, um, now you work with children, so.